A 26-hour vigil was held over the weekend at Soldiers and Sailors Memorial Hall and Museum. The focus was to bring attention to the number of Americans who are still missing in action or who are believed to be prisoners of war. Rick Dayton has the story. America is a very patriotic nation, but we're also at times a forgetful nation. We take things for granted. Every year, they gather to make sure we never forget. To make sure that no American in the history of our country is forgotten, especially those who were prisoners of war and missing in action. The event is sponsored by the Vietnam Veterans Incorporated. Some march, others sing. All remind us there are 83,000 American service men and women still missing from World War II, Korea, the Cold War, and Vietnam. They weren't as fortunate as Saul Gross, who broke out of a German POW camp in April 1944. I was lucky enough that a, a, a few people came by with a horse and wagon and got us out of that area, and then right behind us was a forest with artillery shells going on. The 95-year-old Gross started this event decades ago, and like former state senator and auditor general Jack that Wagner, makes it a priority to bring all soldiers home. There is a bond between Vietnam veterans and veterans in general that is unbreakable. And it's the reason why today we still say, welcome home. And through it all, they remind us to remember. Rick Dayton, KDKA TV News.